Oh, you pussy ass Gemini's. Let's see what's going on. Now I'm just playing Gemini's. What they do is your girl, spiritual guru, 11 11. Let's see what's going on for the Gemini's and the overall energy spirit. What's going on for my Gemini's? Okay, you got worry and service. You need decision at the bottom of the deck. I feel good when I can help others. Okay, that's the first one. It says worry. I am learning that worry doesn't change an outcome. It shows the fuck don't, baby. And in this decision, I use my intuition on all aspects of my life. And I feel like y'all not doing it, Gemini. What's going on? Period. Like, let me just start out with some tarot for y'all. And that's not cool, okay? You know what I'm saying? So what's going to change in y'all situation, huh? I see Ace of Pentacles out here, so I do see somebody stressing about some money, Gemini's. What are y'all stressed about? I see a major arcana's as I shuffle. What's going on, Gemini? Spirit, y'all cannot sleep. Y'all up doing some shit. Uh, y'all watching somebody? Who, who y'all watching? I see a third party out here. Y'all intuitively watching somebody or being guided to? Yeah, oh, y'all can't make it up past priests. Somebody either you intuitively know what's going on. Or you know what's going on and you stalking this person and you hurt. What's going on, Spirit, with these Geminis? Show me what I need to see these Geminis and this highest priestess out here. I feel like y'all invested into a situation. It could be with a uh, Aries Leo, a Sag, or a Gemini Libra Aquarius. Um, Gemini's, and then you, you got judgment in reverse. Somebody on that some heavy, heavy judgment. Like these judgment already done hit, and I feel like he's hitting you and this person. But I feel like he's hitting mainly you because with service, I feel good when I can help others. You got the highest priests out here, so I'm feeling like this is somebody that's supposed to be doing some type of work, and they not doing it. Period. So judgment is on the board for you, but also in a situation that you could be investing yourself into. It's like you stuck on whether you should leave this situation or not. Um, I feel like Gemini, you can have this uh lack mentality. Um, this person can have this lack mentality as well. Um, somebody is this definite obsession out here. Um, with the star Aquarius energy, Queen of Swords, um, Gemini Libra Aquarius. So it's different Aquarius out here on this board, Gemini. So Gemini, you could be dealing with Aquarius, but you need to guard yourself from this person. Okay, you need to guard yourself from this person because this person is very fucking deceptive. This person is jealous as fuck. Um, this could be somebody in your family. This could be somebody you have a family with. This could be somebody that you want a family with. Um, but you need to go within the hill or whatever because this is definitely the three of cups. Somebody out here celebrating with other people. Or they could be celebrating with, with a, a family. Or they could be celebrating with somebody that got a family with. But I feel like oh, you could be dealing with a leave with three to three. I feel like um, you have a spiritual path here. For some of you. I'm going to say for some of you. You have a spiritual path here. But you're being uh, surrounded with the devil. Like, you feel like you have a victory. Or you feel like you have some type of success. But, no. You have a situation full of toxicity. I feel like you are married into a situation with this ring right here. Just thinking that look like a fucking ring. I feel like you are married into a toxic-ass situation. And you could be somebody with this six of one and service come out here. You could be somebody who's of service and you're not using your intuition when it comes to that situation. And that's why your health could be failing. You know, it's a lot of situations that's going on with it. Um, like the Empress out here. Yeah, this person wishing ill will on you. And he, look, I can't make it up. He say he not no good. You know what I'm saying? He not no good. This empress, this person is wishing ill will on you, okay? And they got some type of jail time coming up. And I'm hearing this could be spiritual jail because I'm hearing this, this, these people, whoever this person is, they are the reason why your health is failing. Like, it could be somebody with some dread. I dread out here. It could be somebody with some dreads. 
But yeah, they they look at you like you over emotional and clingy. They talk bad about you. True divine beings don't need to do spells. So it's definitely probably be some spell work out here. But you're not honoring your body. You're not worried about what your desires are at this point. And you have a fucking mission here. And they say you have bad luck because you're in the wrong energy. And that's why you can't sleep. Um, This person is gaslighting you. Like... And they undercover. Like, they could be gay. They mm. say it's time for a family vacation. Being the family. So, it could be some family involved in that shit, too. It's happening now. In the present moment. That this person is still in a cup. Practicing door fusses to keep you stuck. And calling on God to be all the revenge you need. And spirit say, that's the fucking truth. You need to get out of fucking nature. Got plug love murder scene. I feel like you want to hurt somebody or somebody trying to hurt you. You know what I'm saying? Because they don't know they worth for woman's work. Whether it's you or them, they don't know they worth. And I feel like the situation is not going to change. You need to find one who stick by you through thick and thin. I can't make it up. There's too many red flags in this situation. But then when it comes time to go, don't don't leave me. Don't leave me. But you, like I said, you in all this bad looking, this fucked up ass energy because you guilty by association. Because your boyfriend is the money. Boyfriend, girlfriend, take out a resume. You feel like you show me real love is undeniable. No one compares. But this person, they faking. They not who you think they are. These motherfuckers. If fake, false, phony, faux, no, you let them go. They could have low cut hair. You know what I'm saying? You could be your wife. The husband take a high risk lady. It could be your wife. Your wife a demon. Wife, your husband a demon. Take a high risk lady, bro. Your auntie could be trying to tell you, but you're refusing to learn the lesson. Creates bad look. These close friends could be trying to tell you, but these close friends also trying to tell you to stay two steps ahead, or maybe you need to stay two steps ahead of these close friends. Oh yeah. Because they are all teaming up on your ass. They ain't got no fight bone, but they got a lot of fucking energy I'm hearing. Oh, okay. Earthside, Tyrus, Zero, Capricorn. Okay, coming out here. So maybe this could be... And then they don't care. They look what's behind the friends on. They don't care. This person could be a blunt monkey, too. Mm-hmm. Incubus energy. Incubus energy is male entities attached, okay? Sexual entities. They come and drain life from your ass. Okay? Friend zone. This could be a friend that you uh this could be somebody that you friend zone. But you anyway, I mean, period, you just need to watch out for them motherfucking friends for sure. Cause they can have some type of sh uh, shower sex with your man or your woman. You know what I'm saying? Every time Tyrus Rural Capricorn, they could be doing this with a Tyrus Rural Capricorn, okay? You lying, Steve folks are crazy. They say it's not bad look, it's karma. So you done did some too, Gemini. They don't press you for sex cause they value it, yeah. It's a power couple out here that don't, but this person that, that, that you're meant to be in this power couple with, they don't push you for it because they value that from you. You know what I'm saying? But you got somebody that's insecure and jealous of you. And you can pull your tail out your ass, okay? And they say you didn't break something. You can't break something you didn't build, okay? You could be an earth angel. Or this Charles Robert Capricorn could be an earth angel. But yeah, they think it's fun, though. They think it's fun. They broke as fuck anyway. They mad because you got abundance coming in, but you need to give it to God the most high. You know what I'm saying? Because these people are insecure and jealous of you. They 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 jealous of your hustle. You hear me? Um, you could be a mature person and you vibrate too high for their ass. You know what I'm saying? But don't give up. You going places. Somebody out here a heavy drinker. But from the cradle to the grave, this was destined for you. 848. You hear me? And they doing rituals over you in your fucking sleep. That's why the Lord keep your ass up. You been waking up weird ass times, and you know you just laid down and getting back up. Yeah, these motherfuckers over here doing this shit. They don't. I can't make it. Look, this fucking fly trying to fly in my face. Yeah, studying the cup practice right now in the present moment. They doing this shit. That's why you can't use your fucking intuition. Cause, cause they got a fucking neck mentality. Oh yeah, this a trigger warning for somebody. Hold on, this a trigger warning for somebody. Okay, yeah. You made a fool of me, took the same pain and used it against me. So whoever the fuck you was talking to about your motherfucking problems, these motherfuckers have a lack mentality. They probably got father issues. They feeling fucking powerless. And in the midnight hours, they doing spell work over you in your fucking sleep. And you don't need to let nobody knock your path. And you need to be grateful for your alone time and stop being mad at the truth and take account of fucking ability for this shit. Because everything they sitting out backfired, which let me know you're protected, but it's still time for you to see beyond your belief. This person, you could have married this person. 
Will you do the honors of being my wife? Well, this person want to marry you, but the guy ain't told you it's great. They did this shit to keep you stuck. They did that shit to keep you stuck. And I know you got a lady mentality. This could be you, Gemini. You know what I'm saying? But it's too much drama in your situation. You need to have the courage to stand up for yourself and quit attacking. I mean, quit questioning yourself because you're right. These people are attacking your childhood wounds. And you know these motherfuckers got birthday breeze, but you don't give a fuck. You could be a CNA or a nurse. You need to release your ex and be proud of who you are. Okay. Let's get over. Yeah, and stop nagging and complaining. Three through three, three, I told you I just seen that you need to meditate, okay? Because there's too many snakes in, uh, in, in the grave. And somebody definitely leaving shit around you, okay? You got some spirit babies out here, which is, you know, babies that done passed over or that's trying to come. But you definitely going through some type of ascension. They want you to be person, to be, uh, be careful when you're dealing with this person as well. You can be filled with a lot of frustration. Somebody out here is bald headed. Maybe it's the motherfuckers that they dealing with. You feel powerless, but power is powerful, okay? It could be a Libra out here that you could be dealing with, or they could have this in their chart. Or Aquarius, you need to create your altar and be careful when you're around this person because they don't have no remorse. They don't have no remorse for the shit that they doing. Force entry, okay? They trying to force themselves on you like they your twin, that they your person, and they not. They, I'm telling you, they don't even try to propose to you or it had proposed to you, or you already fucking married. But music is like, I feel like music been speaking to you, but they want you to close this fucking cycle out because this person ain't doing nothing ambushing you. They want you to proceed with caution. It's a Taurus out here as well that you need to watch out for too. But they say hug a tree. You know what I'm saying? There's no need to keep trying. You are chosen. You could have been having some type of out of body experience. And, and Gemini, uh, you got mama and daddy issues. So this could be you, okay, with these mama and daddy issues. But I feel like, you know, they burnt their greedy. Somebody making some plans, though. And they choose the bitches over money. They talk about you with the greedy themselves. And you need to protect yourself from this person. But you are protected from this person. So you need to move forward. You could be having somebody who had mama and daddy issues that they hate. Ooh, they know you become. And they are a fucking hater. And God urging you to listen. Um, somebody hired a hitman too. Yeah, I don't know if this shit has to resonate. Jim and nine, Jim and nine. Let's see what's going on with the wisdom. The oracle for my Jim and nine. Okay, we got 20, 23. We got masculine energy. Okay, so we got emperor energy trying to come out. Um, this man wants you to go to business. They want they they want you to go after what it is that your heart desire. They want to come in and exchange gifts with you and make this situation a blessing. I feel like you stuck. Uh, uh, they really want to do this shit righteously by the book, what I'm hearing. But I feel like you stuck in a situation. You know what I'm saying? Like it's by the book. You know what I'm saying? Or a very fucking traditional. You know what I'm saying? But they want you to go to distance. This person want to come in and go to distance. You went big. But you got this fake ass twin that's around you, okay? Care from them fake ass twin. And you not use your fucking intuition. Like, you two be the worried about what other folks going to say. You two be the trying to blame other motherfuckers instead of having the courage to stand up for yourself because you got low self esteem. Because, yeah, they on your ass, Gemini. They say this is you. You know what I'm saying? You got low self esteem. And you know about these third parties. You know. And that's what's stressing you out. Gemini. Gemini, Gemini, Gemini. They said, cut this out, Gemini. Because, you know what I'm saying? You and this person under judgment. Y'all both under judgment. But they, they really on you, Gemini, because you have a mission here and you not doing what you are told to do. So even though you may it may seem like things coming through for you, oh, the Lord, the quicker he gives, he takes away. And that's what you don't know. Like you allowing these negative ass people or this man or woman take out resonates into your energy. And, like, secretly, they are out to destroy you. It's no equal give and take there. They doing magic over you. And they saying, move fucking forward. It's the truth. Move away from this lover. You could have possibly had a kid with them, anything like that, whatever, whatever. Even if it, 
I don't give a fuck if you're not involved. This motherfucker just may be immature and childish for 14, 14, 14 time. You protect yourself from that person and put a death to that shit. An end to that shit. Could be dealing with a Scorpio. I can't make it up the word call. Put an end to who? The devil, the toxicity, this marriage, or whatever it is. It go within a heel and do what it is you need to do because this person is being very fucking deceptive as fuck. Period. The brain just to your situation. So you can celebrate. So you can be appraised. But you definitely dealing with somebody who got you in a third party situation. It could be, and you could be the uh, the third party to a family situation. So take that how it resonates. Uh, she y'all just like Scorpio. God damn it, I just got done doing Scorpio. It's no love on this board from this person. I don't care who it is. You love your person. There's no love on the fucking board at all. Got two cards right behind each other telling you to move forward because it's third parties involved. But they view as wish fulfillment and they, this is Aquarius energy that they probably can have. Yep, they turn it back they back on you for a situation that already hurt them. But I feel like you turn your back towards the truth too as well and still stand in the situation where you got it. So you take this shit how it resonates. You know what I'm saying? 1555 is definitely time to change intuitively. You know what the fuck going on. I, I couldn't even put this in there because you know what's going on. You need to come up out of there. You investing in a situation and this person ain't even investing in you. They want you to take this new beginning. Maybe 